TLDR, so why do you want the Wakes Sling Combo? This is one of the few expandable sling bags that I have tested. With its capacity of 3 to 9 liter and unique design, this is one of the more interesting looking sling bags. And not only is it expandable, but you also can transform it to a shoulder bag. It is part of a whole system, but today we only look at the sling bag itself. The sling bag can be attached to the bigger bag, but also has a small detachable pouch that can be used as an even smaller neck pouch. The bag is very well made out of recycled materials and I just want to applaud the Wakes for their whole environmentally friendly approach of all of their bags. So now that I hopefully got your attention, let's start with the Ismono Raw review of the Wakes Sling Combo. As this is only the second episode of an Ismono Raw review, please let me briefly explain the intention of these videos. All my videos need a lot of production time that just don't fit into my work schedule. As you might know, YouTube is just my passion project and doesn't pay my rent. And instead of keeping you waiting, I wanted to create some videos that are easy to produce with just one camera angle, no edits, but still with enough informative content for you to watch. Hence the name Ismono Raw. So now let's start with the raw review of the Wakes Sling Combo. Alright, let's start with the Ismono Raw. This is the Sling Bag from Wakes, the Sling Combo. Combo because we have two parts. The main Sling Bag, but also this little pouch. This is a neck pouch that can be attached to the Sling Bag itself, which again emphasizes this whole um, system of wakes that is the sling bag, a backpack, the snack pouch and you all can basically connect the individual items to each other. So basically you travel with the bigger backpack to your destination, leave the backpack in the hotel room and then just use this sling combo when you are walking around the city. And what's so great about this is this expandability. So you can basically expand this um, small reg regular sling bag to yeah to a shoulder bag with nine liters of capacity, which obviously can be incredible in the pinch when you're walking around and then you maybe I don't know see. Uh, a sweater and a store and then you buy that sweater and you don't want to carry around a bag then you can just roll this thing up put that sweater inside detach the shoulder strap um, yeah the shoulder straps attach it up here and then you have a shoulder bag instead of a sling bag um, Overall, before I go into the negatives, um, overall I can say this bag is incredibly well made. Although it, it looks like there is some pilling, this is, as far as I understand by intention, this is a recycled fabric and you have this, yeah, it just is part of the look. It's not like it's pilling or anything, It's that's just the fabric it, itself, as far as I um, interpret it. Uh, interpret, or, think about it you have YKK zippers it's the stitching is great uh, the fabrics uh, the buckles are great I attached this S binder on here to attach keys real quick there is a small video in on my channel to showcase this little mod you have a small little compartment quick access compartment here in the front which has a soft inner lining. Um, I would assume that people use this for sunglasses, but honestly, I don't like to store my expensive glasses in a pouch like this where there is potential that the glasses can be crushed. Um, but it's nice to have. I actually store doggy bags in here, empty ones, obviously, when I'm walking with my dog and I have the doggy bags in here. Also great for maybe storing disinfectants that you want to grab quickly in this yeah, area with the pandemic. Um, what, yeah, let's maybe um, insert the negative here real quick because this um, 
closing loop for this G hook for the roll top is quite close to the zipper itself. To the zipper itself. Um, it gets in the beginning it always got stuck on this little bump. You can see it a little bit if I go close, then there it stops here and yeah. So when this bag isn't broken in yet, it it is it feels kind of tight in this space. So you go zip it up up to here, then you have to pull it a little bit down, this a little bit up to get around this little bump, I would say. But as you can see, once it's broken in, and I don't know, maybe this gets a little bit looser, it doesn't stop on this thing again. Turning it around, we have um, the main compartment here. Um, here you have a big, big main compartment, then two slots, which are a little bit too loose for my liking, but this is on many bags. I think they, I have reviewed a lot of bags where you have this little um, elastic that supposedly holds the item in place, but it doesn't. Everything just falls out. I have some tissue here and um, disinfectant wipes that I stored in here, but they can easily just fall out if you're running, for instance. Then you have a zippered compartment um, with a mask that I didn't use. And that's basically a very simplified main compartment, um, but very useful because it's expandable. And yeah, you have this attachable, detachable neck pouch. Never used it in this configuration because as you can see here, this just adds a lot of bulk when you attach this neck pouch to it. And overall, the, the whole um, sling bag with its design and this trapezoid shape um, is very spacious, but therefore, because there is this roll top, it has this trapezoid shape. It is fairly bulky on your back. Um, it's not a negative per se, but it's something to be aware of. This is not a slim sling bag and it can look a little bit bulky on you, especially when this attachment is on the bag itself. Therefore, I actually never used it. I detached it and left it at home. But as you can see here, here are two loops and then the, another loops where you can attach the shoulder strap to have an even smaller simplified sling bag. Great if for a wallet, if your phone, nothing too big and nothing too fancy. Just a simple pouch with some um, soft inner lining in one compartment and then a simple uh, bigger compartment. Pretty nice. Would it fit my... Um, yeah, this is a uh, um, Samsung S21 Plus. So a fairly big phone and it fits Like a, like a glove, meaning it's, it's a little bit fiddly to get in and out, but it fits and if you have a smaller phone, this shouldn't be an issue. Um, one thing to note is this um, shoulder strap. You can tell it already here. It is a little bit um, untidy because this um, shoulder strap is fairly, fairly thin, um, which is good on one hand because it doesn't add to the bulkiness of the bag overall. But then again, these um, strap and organizers don't keep the straps in place that well. So once it's on your bag, most of the time it looks like this, which isn't that pretty and doesn't look that neat. Not sure how to solve this a little bit better, um, maybe some better um, strap and organizers um, but this is just it's not um, negative in terms of usability but a negative in terms of looks i feel like because I, I think the bag is pretty and looks very good despite it being bulky but this yeah if it's on your bag and it looks like this it's not that neat um let me see 
yeah, it looks a little bit messy when just the strap and organizers don't work that well. Um, what did I write down? Yeah, but the, those were honestly the only negatives that I have. So the strap and organizers aren't that great. It is a little bit bulky. The main compartments, elastics, slots don't keep stuff very well in place. Um, but I think the positives being the very well made construction, the environmentally friendly fabrics, um, the look overall outweigh the negatives in my humble opinion. So if you want an expandable sling bag with this kind of construction and you don't mind the bulky appearance of the bag overall, then I would say yeah, definitely take a look at the Wake's uh, sling bag. I would say you don't really need the combo um, unless you actually want this small little neck pouch. I would just go for the sling bag itself and don't um, really need the combo. Um, but yeah, really like this bag. Uh, the expandability, I never used it, but just like insurance, it's better to have it than to need it, <laughs> I guess. Um, if you're going out for shopping and you need a bigger bag in a pinch, then this is pretty cool. So yeah, really like the Wix sling bag. Um, cool design, very well made. Expandability is cool. Yeah, let me know what you think about this bag. So this was the review of the Wix sling combo. Let me know in the comment section below, how do you like this uh, very unique sling bag and do you like expandability with the sling bag? Let me know in the comment section below. And like always, if you have any more questions, also comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, click the like button. And please feel free to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell icon so you won't miss the next videos. Also check out my Instagram at you know the bow. Stay safe and healthy everyone and yeah, see you in the next video. Thank you very much.